Om Shanti, welcome back. Today I'm there in Delhi, Delhi home, and it's quite pleasant over here. It's been raining, so same as Darjeeling, even though it's a little humid and sultry over here. But still, we're going to go ahead, and I missed out my yesterday's blessing because of the travel to Delhi. So let's go ahead with yesterday's blessing. Let's see what does God have to say in 27th of July's Godly blessing. Godfather says, "May you be master merciful." and as well as being a teacher also have forgiveness with the feeling of being merciful so we can't just be a teacher every single time we have to be merciful we have to give away our ego that i know the knowledge i have a lot of knowledge i have a lot of understanding there has to be a balance between the head and the feelings and say it or call it heart its emotions have to be in balance with our thinking so god says in order to receive everyone's blessing along with being a teacher also be master merciful now this is for receiving blessings because when we are always a teacher and not giving any amount of understanding and love to other people or having any form of realization of how do they feel then blessings don't come towards us other people generally they feel that we are always coaching them teaching them pressurizing them to change so there has to be a balance be merciful with forgiveness and this forgiveness will become like giving a teaching to that one you mustn't just become a teacher but you must also forgive only by using these sanskars or these habits will you be able to give blessings to everyone make the sanskars of giving blessings firm from now and people will then continue to take blessings from your non living images now these are the images which we have been talking about which are there in the different temples the deity form so our divine form will be invoked and whenever we are giving any form of teaching along with mercy that's the time people will really feel that we care about them and it's not just about caring about self that that you change so that my life becomes better no you change so that your life becomes better and that is a real blessing so god says for this while moving along take every step according to shrimat shrimat means godly guidance and make your account of blessings full we can only give blessings to others when we have blessings within us that means when we have good wishes good thoughts towards others and we are not just thinking only about ourselves through our intellect we are thinking about feelings of others how to help them how to guide them in this path so remember that forgiveness is also when we understand other people's feelings and we have mercy over them and that mercy can only come when we have the knowledge about that being or that energy or that souls previous many 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 births and what they have been doing and how they have come about with that insecurity or with that depression or with that kind of thinking in their life and when we understand that with our feelings then we can guide them then only they'll understand what we have to say you too can understand this with the godly spiritual knowledge given at brahma kumaris and you can understand your previous births you can understand every soul you can understand the feelings of every soul and be in alignment with all the five elements and all the souls in this world with this omshanti